To be the best, you got to beat the best. And y'all ain't beat me yet. I told y'all that back in 2006 when I started this. I started this with toilets at my store on Falls Road, and I'm still using toilets. Call it potty training politicians because people pay attention to dumbass shit. And y'all got some dumbass shit going on. N62528. Yeah, that's my retirement plan. I used to be a drug dealer. The drug dealing, the game ain't got no retirement plan, ain't got no 401k, so I created my own. I was making a movie about the war on drugs. The money the judges, the lawyers, and the politicians get paid to lock up black America. We traded the penitentiary for the plantation, cotton for cocaine, and your kids is the cash crop. In 2010, I blew the whistle on Governor O'Malley, Judge Janae, and 45 judges that Governor O'Malley had in place across the state of Maryland. It's a criminal enterprise. If you Google search Operation Greylord, that's all I did. I did Operation Greylord on Baltimore City and Baltimore County. Now, Johnny Oleski don't want to talk to me. Mr. Fields from the Baltimore County Law Department don't want to talk to me. It's been 10 years and you took property from me. At the conclusion of a trial, uh, the defendant is supposed to be compensated for his losses. That's in the Constitution. I was making a movie called I Am Dred Scott. I got 13 movies, but Dred Scott is the most important one. That's Dred Scott, 2010. All right, Governor O'Malley's mom machine, and I broke you down. And I gave that information to ABC2 News. I gave that information to leaders of a beautiful struggle. I gave that information to, to Stephanie Smith. I gave that information to Benjamin Brooks. I gave that information to, yeah. These are the supporters of shorties. And we was talking about the prison industry and the money you make off the war on drugs. In Baltimore City and Baltimore County, stop and frisk and zero tolerance. Yeah. Town hall, community in crisis? No, it's by design. That's the Baltimore Sun, that's ABC, NBC, and CBS. And these is your elected officials. Tony Bridges used to work for Governor Ho Governor O'Malley. Mayor Pugh. Bill Ferguson. I was making a movie. And I got it all documented. And we talking about the war on drugs. Because in 1977, 78, 9, I was on Iran Contra. We was transporting drugs. That's Kiefer Mitchell and Kurt Anderson. Y'all know about it. See who that is? Like I said, I was making a movie about it. The haves versus the have-nots. The great race debate. You feel me? The great race debate. So leaders of a beautiful struggle, let's have that great race debate. You want to talk about black leadership and how, how strong you are in the community? Let's talk about it. Because I'm still standing. I'm standing so strong, they just gave me the Weaver Award. I went from, from terrorist to the Baltimore's best. From Baltimore's worst to Baltimore's best. Like I said, to be the best, you got to beat the best. And you ain't beat me yet. I'm still standing. I was making a movie. And that's President Obama. See that? That's Frank Conway, the Judiciary Committee. That's Robin Lewis. Right there, NAACP. Pastor Jamal Bryant. Ben Cardins and Donald Trump. My end game is the Supreme Court, Chief Justice Roberts, because in 2007, I informed Chief Justice Roberts what I was doing. I was making a movie. So let's have this great race debate. You get your best five against me, and we'll see what we can do here. All right? We'll see what we can do here. Because what you do in the dark... Always comes out in the light. Get your representatives, because I'm making toilets. Get your representatives, and that's the criminal charges. The best of Baltimore, 2022.